New at 10, a two-day event bringing culture to Concord takes place this weekend. It will be the third year Creative Concord has brought artists and musicians together for a celebration. KTV's Amber Lee live in Concord tonight to give us a sneak preview. Hi, Amber. Hi, Christina. We're at Toto Santos Plaza in the heart of downtown Concord. Now, not live music will take place here and artwork will be displayed on buildings nearby and thousands are expected to attend. I love public art because it gives people the chance that maybe would not normally go into a museum. Jury is among several artists who are creating new murals for an event called Creative Concord 2024 that will take place this weekend. The artwork reflects who she is as a Japanese American from Oklahoma City. I love painting Japanese themes because I feel like it's the truest expression of myself. Uh, I can't express it in words. This artwork illustrates a sword dance, a tribute to Concord's sister city relationship with Kitakami, a city in Japan. To look beyond borders or familiar areas and to know that there's so many people waiting to just meet you and be friends. Brian Ariaga is a native of Concord. He's created art for Creative Concord since its inception three years ago, helping bring culture to Concord. The artist says his work tells his story about daring to dream. California dreaming, dreaming. It's like everyone has a dream. For me, it was always to live off my art. So for me, that's why I'm like, I feel it's only appropriate for dreaming to be the word to choose for here. In total, the event will feature six murals. This one from an artist originally from South Africa each stroke, bringing to life what Kia Tama describes as a love letter to Concord. The mural could maybe be like a place of recognition of the town or kind of like the love and community here. This right here is a traffic light. San Francisco artist Dana Albany uses all recyclable materials for her mosaic. They include street signs, dishes, mirrors, and pottery. Albany says it's her first time in Concord and being a part of this event. I'm bringing all the muralists and artists to this town and the town's open and willing to have different art on different buildings, so it's an honor. And there will be live music to go with the mosaic and murals. Performers will be Bay Area musicians. We're not just focusing on visual arts, we want the performing arts as well. It all plays together. Creative Concord will be held this Saturday and Sunday. The artworks will be displayed on various buildings around downtown. The event is free. For more information, go to ktvu.com and click on Weblinks. Christina. The talent some people have is just incredible. Amber, thank you for that report.